Welcome back, everybody. Meteorologist Kevin Lawrence with you. Temperatures are not faring so bad here. A few upper 20s near the Canadian border. Rolla 28, 37 in Minot. Uh, we've had a really nice day again today. Did you catch that beautiful sunset that we had here not too long ago? Very nice indeed. Light south winds here for our Tuesday evening around 5 to 10 miles per hour. It, you just couldn't ask for a better week for travel conditions, getting to and from. Uh, of course, we've had much more difficult Novembers like last year. You may recall, I think we all do this year. Traveling is uh, simply superb throughout the Northern Plains. Calm weather, a bit of a breeze at times. We will have falling temps for tomorrow afternoon, but again, setting the stage for a below freezing Thanksgiving day, but not bad. Oh, even overnight lows tonight near 32 degrees. That's well above the norm here because of southwest winds. Whenever we have southwest winds here in Minot, we are often a little bit milder than surrounding areas. So 32 in the Magic City, Stanley at 30, 26 in Botno and in a rugby. Again, just a little bit of a breeze here with a mostly cloudy day expected for one of the busiest travel days throughout the country of the year. Uh, so I think we're going to, with the north winds, we're going to have the highs of the day mid to late morning and then falling into the afternoon, likely below freezing here. But again, a lot of cloud cover might see a little bit of morning sun and then quickly clouding over here. We can actually see that rather clearly in the forecast. We've got nice weather this evening, but watch the clouds coming in from Canada, moving right into northern North Dakota by, let's say, oh, eight, nine, ten o'clock tomorrow morning. And we remain mostly cloudy for a majority of our day. Chances for some light snow showers, no accumulation is expected. The air is just simply too dry and the source region of our air is a lot colder, but it's also going to result in a bit of a pattern of snow, not for us, but for Montana, Wyoming and eventually Colorado over the next several days. So if your travel plans do take you toward Wyoming and Colorado, travel might actually become a little bit on the tricky side by Thanksgiving Day night into our Black Friday. But for our area, Things are looking a okay now for tonight, hour by hour or really tomorrow morning, 34 degrees in Minot already at 7 a.m. with a high of 39. Again, that's going to be midday because by 5 p.m. will be around 32 degrees, uh, not getting really, really cold, but the high of the day during the middle portion of our day, a botano high of 34 early on. Our seven day forecast here for the Magic City. It will be colder, but again, great travel weather Thursday, 22 degrees for the high 28 on Friday. Now between Thursday, Thursday and Friday, we're going to have overnight lows in the single digits. Rather cold. It would be a lot colder. We would be sub zero if we had snow on the ground, but we simply don't. For the weekend, breezy at times. Uh, Saturday and both Saturday and Sunday actually be breezy here with temperatures back into the uh, upper 20s to the low 30s and overnight lows mostly in the teens. But again, no major travel weather woes. All right, thank you so much for that, Kevin.